The man, the myth, the legend. Over the past three decades, Keanu Reeves has established himself as much more than an actor. But what if we told you that John Wick wasn't Keanu Reeves' best performance? You might think we are crazy, delusional even. But what if we also told you his best performance actually happened back in 1991? Here's the list of Hollywood icon Keanu Reeves' nine best performances so far. Both a hero on and off the screen, Keanu has completely captivated audiences with his kind-hearted nature and outstanding performances, one of which was his truly entertaining performance in the comedy Always Be My Maybe. Nice are perfect. This is for a party. They don't even have lenses in them. See? Who can forget the cocky hipster in this movie, aka a side of him we have never seen before. Despite being nothing like the real Reeves, he does an excellent job of persuading us that it could be. Simply put, Reeves was born to play this role, and if it were played by anyone else, it would simply not hit the same. But unlike his free-spirited performance, his portrayal in Point Break was much more serious. Listen, Bunker, I'm actually really glad you found me. Yeah? Why? It is true that Point Break was a breakout hit for Reeves, and obviously it is one of the movies fans loved him in most, so what kind of character does he play? Reeves portrays an FBI agent who goes undercover to infiltrate a gang of surfers who rob banks. And trust us when we say that the movie makes this storyline a lot more fascinating and believable than it seems. It's one of those movies you just have to see to understand the hype. Now, Reeves' unwavering dedication to the role and refusal to wink at the camera are two big factors that made the movie an instant box office success. Point Break is also the beginning of it all for Reeves. That's not what I'm talking about. They only live to get radical. They don't have any real understanding of the sea, so they'll never get this. He instantly became a rising star because of his ability to establish himself as a go-to action hero. And from this point onwards, Reeves became the people's hero in almost every role he played. A living legend, if you ask us. Now, this next film features one of Reeves' most surprising and intense performances. Yep, you guessed it. We are talking about the movie The Gift. There are many adjectives we could use to describe the majority of Reeves' performances, but terrifying isn't one of them. You ain't no better than a Jew or nigger. However, The Gift is the exception. It's a performance that calls on Reeves to play the exact opposite of his cool, heroic character that we all know and love. I'm gonna use this voodoo doll on you, some of your own medicine, if you don't stop seeing my wife. Instead of turning into someone angry and despicable, he does it with flying colors. It's almost bizarre to see Reeves in this kind of role. Reeves plays a scary and violent local townie who turns his wrath on a clairvoyant, ultimately murdering her. Also, sorry about the spoilers, but if you haven't seen The Gift yet, well, you must. Now, unlike The Gift, this next film is probably the only superhero movie you will see Reeves appear in. But we are certainly not mad about it. I mean, it only continues to prove that Reeves could very well be the best actor of our generation. Seriously, is there any role this man cannot play? But what movie are we talking about? Constantine, of course. Along with John Wick, Constantine is one of the best movies Keanu Reeves has done since the Matrix trilogy. Hi. My name's John. Based on a graphic novel, Constantine stars Reeves as DC Comics character John Constantine, a demon hunter whose sole purpose on Earth is to send demons back to the nether regions. And no, we don't mean that kind of nether region. This is a strong supernatural thriller in one of Reeves' more unconventional roles. Okay, we are officially entering our top four picks. And obviously, this list wouldn't be complete without the film's speed. Drugs trade! A true adrenaline kick from beginning to end, Speed also almost instantly turned Keanu into a true leading man and a big action star. It also had a big influence on the action movies that followed. Speed follows the story of a bus that has been rigged to explode if it slows down below 50 miles per hour. It was a huge box office hit for Reeves in the early 1990s and got all of Hollywood's attention. To warn you, I've heard relationships based on intense. To put it bluntly, Reeves may have never found himself in future hits like The Matrix or John Wick without speed. Can you imagine a world where someone else plays John Wick? That is a world we do not want to be a part of. Speaking of The Matrix, what can we say about The Matrix that hasn't already been said? The first Matrix film, released in 1999, was groundbreaking with its special effects. Come on, who can forget the iconic bullet time action sequences? They will be ingrained in our memory forever. The Matrix also drastically helped change filming technology for future films. There is no spoon. 
Then you'll see that it is not the spoon that bends, it is only yourself. The original story, about machines using humans as batteries while their brains were kept occupied in a simulated world, was also pretty inventive. Something we had never seen before on the big screen. As Mr. Anderson, aka Neo, aka The One, Reeves gives us a great performance while still managing to have some fun along the way. I repeat, we are under attack! <laughs> In The Matrix, Reeves can break into some super slick kung fu and keep the material grounded and from becoming too silly. And to this day, many people will still debate whether they would take the blue or red pill. What would you choose? Do you want to know what it is? Now, you could say that The Matrix walked so John Wick could run. It's no secret that Reeves has been in some major movies with bigger box office totals. Remember. All I'm offering is the truth, nothing more. Yet we feel that this is the one that Reeves will be remembered for when all is said and done. We are talking about the groundbreaking and jaw-dropping action film series, John Wick. The film's many action scenes have been hailed as some of the best and most iconic action scenes in cinema history, with the Red Circle shootout and the knife room fight being among the best ever created. And obviously, without discrediting the contributions of the rest of the cast and crew, the success of John Wick can mainly be attributed to Reeves himself. His committed performance as a grieving hitman is one that you will never forget. <laughs> Not only did Reeves dedicate himself to the role of a solitary killer silently mourning the loss of his wife, he also fully dedicated himself to the role's physicality. Did you know that Reeves had extensive training for the role with every firearm used and martial arts training for the hand-to-hand -hand fight scenes? I noticed. Watching him and also knowing he performed all the action scenes, we can't seem to get enough, and that makes him much more cool in our books. And just like Reeves will forever be remembered for John Wick, he will also be remembered and praised for his role in this 1991 film, the moment you have been waiting for, taking out the number one spot, his performance in My Own Private Idaho. If you have never seen or heard of this movie, well, it was released way back in 1991, but was arguably Reeves' best performance ever. In the film, Reeves plays a man living on the streets of Portland, working as a male escort and hustling alongside his best friend. The pair then embark on a journey of self-discovery and find a deeper relationship along the way. Of course, at the time of its release, it was very controversial because of the homosexuality in the movie. Nevertheless, it won critical acclaim and numerous awards, all thanks to Reeves. So from playing a cocky hipster in Always Be My Maybe to performing all of his own breathtaking stunts in John Wick, these were Keanu Reeves' best performances ranked.